Sankhita Chita they translate as contracted mind. This is Shiranga mind accompanied with Sud and Topa. We create that Chita they translate as distracted mind. This is one that I mean. <coughs> Sorry. Another mistake is Kudrabhu. Hmm? Last night I told Kudrabhu. There are two types of Kudrabhu. Before jhana, and they make full absorption stage. There is also Kudrabhu. <coughs> Before path inclusion knowledge, there is also Kudrabhu. Last night, my mistake is Before path knowledge, Kudrabhu. I explain. I must explain Before jhana, Kudrabhu. Hmm? Before jhana, Kudrabhu is change of lineage. How it change? <coughs> change of lineage means the pra change of the pra since we are lineage to prime material lineage or immaterial lineage. Mm -hmm. This is before jhana stage good rabu. Before path knowledge there's also good rabu. That good rabu is change of lineage. That change of lineage is the change of Warling lineage to noble lineage. Yesterday I said this good rabu. Hmm? Sorry. Hmm? So please hmm? correct. Today we will discuss about Dhamanu Bhasana. Now, before we are discussing about Dhamanu Bhasana, I want to explain the series of teaching. Hmm? In this Mahasri Prana Sutta, Buddha first teach Kaya Nupasana. Kaya Nupasana is contemplating body as body. Hmm? In this Kaya Nupasana session, Anabana Samatha meditation also include because this is also Kaya. What Kaya? If you can do some four elements in your breath, you can see breath is nothing but a group of small body gas kalaba. These kalabas, if you analyze, at least they are nine types of materiality, such as earth element, water element, fire element, wind element, color, odor, paper, nutritive essence, and breathing sound. So they are a group of kalabas, so they are also called kaya or body. When your concentration develops further, you may see here nimeda. The breath began nimeda. When your concentration develops further, then the, this nimeda will begin padibhaga nimeda one day. Counterpart sign. What is that counterpart sign padibhaga nimeda? <laughs> this is also originally produced by my but my produced material is only internally, not externally. Now, from outside the nostril, you can see this nimeta also. This nimeta is origina originating with hmm? cause is only mind. But outside the nostril, in Istana, this is temperature produced materiality only. How temperature produced? In mind produced calabas, there are, in each calaba, there is fire element deja. That deja is called temperature. That temperature can produce 
uncountable new generations, not only internally but also externally. So external countable sign is that temperature produced materially. But that temperature is <coughs> in my produced materially only. That mind is not ordinary mind. This is especially excess concentration or absorption concentration mind. Concentrated mind only. That concentrated mind can produce uncountable calabas. In each calabas, in every calabas, there is fire element tejo. That tejo temperature can produce uncountable generations up to its standard. Wow. So this is also a numita is nothing but a group of small body gas, a group of calabas only. So they are also called body. Whether this translation is correct or not, I don't know. They translate this body as body. Hmm? Because they rise as a group of me. Because of this reason, in Kaya Nubhasana, Samatha meditations such as Anabhana, such are also in group. Then Buddha especially emphasizes discerning materiality. Again, again, contemplation is contemplation of feeling. In the Vrinna Nubhasana chapter, Buddha especially emphasizes Vrinna. The another chapter is Chaitanya Nubhasana, contemplation of mind as mind. This chapter is virtually emphasized mind. So, materiality, feeling, consciousness. Three. Then the remaining mental factors are there still. So, this, the remaining mental factors are how many? Hmm? Sister Susila is hmm? 52 mental factors. Among 52 mental factors, only feeling is directly Buddha mentioned in Vrinna Nubhasana, contemplation of Vrinna as Vrinna. So, the remaining 50 ones are still there. So, because of this reason, to, to contemplate the remaining 51 mental factors, Buddha also teach the Manupasana. But feeling, consciousness, the remaining mental factors, always they arise together. They are associated in each my, my, my moment together. But 51 or 52 mental factors not always arise together. They are separately. In one mind moment, in middle of the in some mind moment, ten headers, ten middle of the in some mind moment, the degree, middle of the etc. In this way, they rise. Not all together. So, according to cognitive process, they rise. In each mind moment, you must discern feeling. When you discern feeling, <coughs> you, sh you should not discern feeling alone. You must discern <coughs> associated mental formations with feeling also. When you discern consciousness, you must not discern only consciousness, you must also discern associated mental factors also. When you discern other mental factors, how you should emphasize? Only among these 51 mental factors, <coughs> contact is important. <coughs> so they are. When you are discerning ultimate materiality, there are two ways. Four elements meditation in brief way. Four elements meditation in a wider way. Only these two ways. You can do any way. You can do both. No problem. When discerning mentality, there are three ways. By way of feeling, or by way of consciousness, or by way of contact, person. For some meditators, while they are discerning mentality, feeling is very predominant. Feeling becomes predominant factor. When feeling becomes predominant factor, they can emphasize feeling. But feeling alone is not enough because they are associated mental formations in each mind moment. So they must also discern associated mental formations which arise together with feeling. But for some meditators, consciousness, cognizing 
object very clear. If consciousness is very clear, then they must they can discern consciousness. But consciousness alone is not enough. Why? Consciousness always arises together with associated mental factors, chilisi gas. Chaja and chilisi gas, they always arise together. So because of this reason, <coughs> when you discern chaja consciousness, chaja alone you must not discern. You must also discern associated mental formations according to cognitive process. The person meditators contact fasa is very clear, predominant fata, while they are discerning mentality. If contact fasa is clear, predominant fata, then they can begin by way of contact, but contact alone is not enough. Contact always arises with associated mental formations. These associated mental formations also you must discern according to cognitive process. <coughs> so, while you are discerning mentality, there are three ways. You can begin by Virana, by way of Virana, or by way of Chaita, or by way of Pasa. But, but Virana alone, or Chaita alone, or Pasa alone is not that. You must always discern associated mental formations together. Because of this reason, these three are same. If you practice Virana Nubhasana, contemplation of Virana, you must also discern associated mental formations which rise together with Virana. When you discern consciousness, when you emphasize consciousness, you must not alone discern consciousness, you must also discern associated mental factors, mental factors which rise together with consciousness. When you do some fasa, well, fasa is predominant. You must do some not only fasa, but also the associated mental formations which arise together with fasa. If you gain data in this way, these three contemplations, contemplation of feeling, contemplation of mind, contemplation of dhamma objects, all these three are same. Before you are discerning this, one of these or these hmm? mentalities, but you must already discern ultimate materiality. Without discerning ultimate materiality, without understanding ultimate materiality with your direct knowledge, you cannot discern ultimate mentality according to cognitive process. Because, for example, I do cognitive process. I question among idol cognitive process, there are different memos all together, 40 memos, my moments. More 40 I consciousness rise depending on I based on. If this is only one my moment, one my moment is very quick. That I consciousness rise together with associated eight and seven associated mental factors. All together there are eight mental factors, mental formations. If you cannot discern any transparent element or any sensitivity, you cannot understand this I consciousness when associated mode mental formations arise here. You cannot understand. So because of this reason, without discerning ultimate materiality, if you discern ultimate mentality, you cannot understand according to you cannot discern cognitive process according to cognitive process these mentalities, mental informations. In each my moment you cannot discern associated mental informations also. So this is the way this is the way of practice of Sadhibhatana. Sadhibhatana they translate Foundations of mindfulness. Hmm? So, if you want to practice Sadhibhana Mata, according to this way of explanation or this series, you must practice. So, how you should contemplate the remaining mental formations, except when mental fantasy. Hmm? 
by way of project. So project is plain here, number one. Five new granite sections. In the Manu Basana, there are five sections. Among five sections, number one is new granite, Baba, new granite session. New granite is, what is new granite? New granite is hindering that they translate. Hmm? The hindering se session, hmm? how about that teach? It didn't just break away, break up. The Mesu, the Manu Basi, we heard it. It didn't break away, break up. The Mesu, the Manu Basi, we heard it. Then just so, new Varan is so. It didn't just break away, break up. The Mesu, the Manu Basi, we heard it. Then just so, new Varan is so. It didn't break away, break up. Sandawa, Ija Dangami, Chandra, Atime, Ija Dangami, Chandra, Dipa, Janadi. Asandawa ija dangami chandwa nati me ija dangami chandwa di bata nati. Dada jya anubha nasa gami chandwa sa upadu ho di dinja bata nati. Yadha jya upadu nasa gami chandwa sa pahana ho di dinja bata nati. Yadha jya bhi nasa gami chandwa sa ayade anubadu ho di dinja bata nati. This is the way of instruction how you should practice neuronal session. This is number one. They are five new neuronas. Now this hmm? this is number one. Neurona Kame Chanda Neurona. What is the meaning? Hmm? How does how vehicles does a vehicle contemplate the mark objects as the mark object? What are the mark object? The remaining 51 middle factors are also called the mark object. But in Kayanu Vasana session, Buddha emphasizes materiality. In Vrindanu Vasana session, Buddha emphasizes Vrindanu feeling. In Chidanu Vasana session, Buddha emphasizes Chidya, mind consciousness. In the Mahas Nubhasana session, Buddha emphasizes the remaining 51 mental factors. So, Adhimi Madhiriyadi, Philae, Consciousness, 51 mental factors, all together they are Adhimi Mentality and Madhiriyadi only. Again, this Adhimi Mentality, Madhiriyadi divide into five portions, they become five aggregates. So, High aggregate method also mentioned in this Tamanu Vasana session. In the same way, when this ultimate mentality and mentality divide into 12 parts, they are they begin 12 ironas, 12 pages. This 12 pages session also mentioned in under the Tamanu Vasana. Okay, while you are contemplating this five aggregates or 12 ironas, types of pages. You must try by way of survey enlightenment pattern, Bhujanga. So Bhujanga session also mentioned in this chapter. Then last one is Honova Truth. Honova Truth chapter, how you should practice Vipassana by way of Honova Truth. This is also mentioned in this chapter. So because of this reason, this Tamal Nubasana is very wide. Hmm? So number one is Nirana session. Hmm? So how does Bhikkhus a Bhikkhu contemplate Tamal objects as Tamal objects? These are five aggregates, two Aranas, etc. These are Tamal objects. Here in this Buddha's dispensation, a Bhikkhu avoids contemplating Tamal objects as Tamal objects in terms of Hindering sets, Nivaranas. Hmm? How does a Bhikkhu advise contemplating the mark objects as the mark objects in terms of five hindering sets? So, in this way, for coming Chanda Nivarana, sensual desire, Buddha explains five sentences. Number one is Sandangwa Ija Dangami Chandra Adhimi Ija Dangami Chandra Dipa Janadi. There being a sensual desire in him, a vehicle understands. 
Here is CGA desire in me. This is very important. What is sensual desire? Hmm? They are, uh, in this case, sensual desire is six types. Hmm? Attachment to the color, attachment to the sound, attachment to the smell, attachment to the taste, attachment to the tangible objects, attachment to the dhamma objects. Among dhamma objects, 52 mental factors also include. The remaining 16 subtle materialities also include. Kala is Ruba, Ruba Ramana is Kala, Sadha Ramana is Song, Kanda Ramana is Smell, Rasa Ramana is Taste, Kudhava Ramana is Tejivar Object. Tejivar Object means Up element, fire element, and wind element. These three elements are called tangible objects. You can test here. Yeah. If you test, you can feel hardness, roughness, heaviness, or softness, smoothness, lightness. This is up element. You can feel heat or cold. <coughs> this is fire element. You can feel pushing and supporting. This is wind element. When you are touching, then you can feel these three types of tangible objects only. So these are tangible objects. The remaining materialities or materialities amount 28. Huh? The remaining mate 21 materialities are the objects. Huh? They are included under the Dhamma objects. Attachment to this object is called sensual desire. Among these Dhamma objects, insensitivity, and transparent element also include. Have you attachment to your eye? <laughs> you have attachment to your eye. You have attachment to your ear. You have attachment to your nose. You have attachment to your tongue. You have attachment to your body, heart, etc. Huh? These are Dhamma objects. Hmm? You have attachment to color, this is very easy. Color, smell, sound, smell, taste, tangible object. So these six types of attachments are called sensual desire. If you have sensual desire in you, then you must understand I have sensual desire in me. If you do not understand, you cannot escape from the wrong or rebirth. Because you do not understand do yourself well. If you have attachment, then you must understand I have attachment. What is this attachment? How you should discern? Hmm? So if you want to discern attachment, for example, taking color, if you have attachment to the color, if you want to discern this attachment, how you should practice? Number one, you must discern I see it sensitivity. Number two, you must discern mind or point out. Then you should try to discern the color object which you have attachment. When this color object impinge both doors at the time, eye cognitive will process arise. Among these eye cognitive process, number one is hydro advantage consciousness. Number one, two, three, four. Number four. Number five is decision consciousness. These two types of consciousness decide. Oh, this is very beautiful. <laughs> then, if you decide this object very beautiful, then strong, powerful attachment will arise. This attachment not automatically arise. You are meant to create this attachment. Is it true? Yes. Mm. Mm. This is very dangerous. <laughs> very dangerous means as long as you accept this attachment, you cannot escape from the round or rebirth. This is fundamental cause. Because of this reason, Buddha emphasized the origin, the noble truth of the origin of Dukkha is Tana. Craving, attachment, or greed. Hmm? Hmm. Not greed. 
This is the origin of Dukkha. Dukkha, you can say, because it creates many wholesome and wholesome karmas. Oh, if you want hmm, to be man, then you must accumulate wholesome karmas to be man. If you want to be a woman, then you must accumulate wholesome karmas to be a woman again. Not only like that, but oh, you also want to meet each other in this life. Is it true? <laughs> Then you must accumulate whole sound mass. Because of this craving, you accumulate this whole sound mass. Then if you are accumulated in this way, whole sound or whole sound mass, then these commas will produce again and again. If they can produce new rebirth, new existence again and again, then you cannot escape from the round of rebirth. You must always always take pretty sandy in your mother's home again. Okay. Then you, ma you, you will be, you are liable to all, you are liable to sick, you are liable to death. Again, but all sick, death, but all sick, death. In this way, <coughs> round of rebirth is, will continue because of this craving. Because of this reason, Buddha says, if you have, since you are desire, then you must try to understand, I have. Since you desire. Is it good? If you want to escape from the round or rebirth, you must try to understand this since you are desire. But this since you are desire arrives in the for example, I do cognitive mind process. Only join up my movement. But this since you are desire, desire is craving or lust or greed. Eh? It cannot rest alone. It always rest with associated mental formation. So, if you can break down the competence of mentality, other than only you will understand ultimate materiality, ultimate mentality. If you cannot break down the competence, then you cannot understand ultimate materiality. Only you may understand, oh, this is sensual desire, or oh, this is craving, or this is attachment, or this is lust. In this way, only superficially you may understand. You cannot penetrate the ultimate material mentality because you cannot break down the competitiveness. So to break down the competitiveness, how you should practice? Number one, you must design eye sensitivity. Secondly, you must design mind of pointer. Then you should try to design the color which you have attachment. When this gala impedes for those other than only this, I know cognitive will rise. In the place of seven jhana moment, this craving will rise, this sensual desire will rise together with associated mental formations. What are associated mental formations? Huh? Sister Susila explains in Prochata. I have no Prochata. <laughs> <laughs> so I cannot explain. Hmm? You should try to design this, yeah? maybe 20 or 22 or 90, etc. These mental formations. Hmm? Other than that, only you will understand. I have sensual desire. But another sentence yeah? this is Sandawa, Ejan Dangami Chando, Atime Ejan Dangami Chando, Diva Janadi. There being a sensual desire in you. You must try to understand, I have sensual desire in me. This is one sentence. Another sentence is, Asandawa ijandangami chando nati me ijandangami chando di pajanadi. There being no sensual desire in you, you must try to understand, there is no sensual desire in me. If there is sensual desire in you, you must try to understand, there is sensual desire. If there is no sensual desire in you, then you should also try to understand there is no sensual desire in you. How you should try? <laughs> because there are whole sound demands and whole sound demands, they cannot rise simultaneously. If there is whole sound demands rising and passing, a whole sound demands cannot rise together. If there are a whole sound demands rising and passing, in the same way, there are whole sound demands also cannot rise. So because of this reason, 
if you have no sensual desire, what my moments arising in passing away? Usually, whole frontal mass. Hmm? But when whole frontal mass arises in passing away, usually they arise according to cognitive process only. If you can do the cognitive process, then we can say you already understand passionate consciousness, resulting consciousness, and wholesome consciousness. So they all will include. In the same way, when you are discerning a wholesome Thomas, especially which are associated with sense desire, sensual desire. And then also you will understand passionate consciousness, resulting consciousness, as well as a wholesome Thomas. So you should try to discern according to this cognitive process. Then, if there is no sensual desire, what, what type of hmm, consciousness will arise? Maybe Josa, maybe rice, this is also a whole santama. Delusion also may arise, this is also a whole santama. Or maybe conceit, jealousy, envy, etc., this also may arise. You should try to discern this a whole santama. <coughs> but not only taking color as object, but also song, smell, taste, tangible object, object and other. Tama objects. Taking these different objects also, this a whole sort of much, eh? including sensual desire, will arise. You should try in the same way, this the cognitive process. When this sensual desire is absent in your mentality process, you should also try to understand, oh, there is no sensual desire in me. When it will not arise, now you are listening to my talk. Have you any attachment? No, no, present only. No attachment. <laughs> you are listening to my only. At that time, no attachment, no anger. Who's on to us and such as we are saying, passing me? How you should listen? For example, you should listen. I sensitivity. Yes. Yeah, yes, yeah, sensitivity. Okay, sorry. Then, number two, going up my door. Then please listen my tomato song. When this song impedes both doors, you will... Oh, this is very good tomato. Huh? Who does this say? In this way, if you decide, then you will understand whose song tomato, listening tomato. This whose song tomato will arise in Joanna place. Hmm? Seven Joanna place. This whole song tomato may be, if you have a happy mind, there may be 34 mental factors. Hmm? These 34 mental factors are very important. While you are contemplating uh, Samatha meditation, at that time also these 34 are uh, working. When you are contemplating Vipassana, when you are practicing Vipassana, these 34 only. These 34 are very important. Hmm? Well, in every stage of Vipassana, these 34 mental factors are very important. You should try to understand. When these 34 mental factors are rising and passing away successfully, gain and gain, at the dying, sensual desire will be not rising in your mind. Because whole symptoms are rising. When whole symptoms are rising and passing away successfully, at the dying, before whole symptoms, at least there are five in the body consciousness, ear to consciousness, huh? ear consciousness, receiving consciousness. Uh, investigating consciousness, decision consciousness, this function and eh, presenting consciousness also will only arise. If your object is very clear, maybe after Jonas, there are two types of registering mind also will arise, together with associated mental formations. So they are functioning and presenting in eh, whole sort of mass. When this function eh, consciousness Resulting consciousness and wholesome consciousness are rising and passing away successfully. At the dying, sensual desire is not present in your mind. So, this wholesome term also you must decide again. When sensual desire is not absent, uh, when sensual desire is absent, at the dying, this function Resulting in wholesome tomas are uh, successfully rising in passing away. You must also try to design these middle formations according to six two cognitive process. So if you have 
sensual desire, you must also understand I have sensual desire. If you have no sensual desire, then you must also understand I have no sensual desire. But understanding means according to cognitive process, you must try to understand the ultimate mentality only. Hmm? So, to understand this ultimate mentality, then first we must try to discern ultimate materiality. Without discerning ultimate materiality, you cannot discern this ultimate mentality up to ultimate truth stage, hmm? Pramata. This is not enough. The Nanda Buddha taught. Yet, Hancha Anubha Nasa Kami Chanda Sa Ubado Hodi Genja Pajanagi. How? He must try to understand how there comes to be the rising of non rising sensual desire. How this arises? This is to bring the origination. <laughs> you should try cause and effect. Why this sensual desire arise? Why? <laughs> this is important. You accept different objects. Because of object also, because of base, because of object, because of fasa, contact, <coughs> these are present objects. Not only this, because of the associated mental formations. Without associated mental formations, since sensual desire alone cannot arise. So without this, without this, heart base and eye base, etc. Without this also, sensual desire cannot arise. Because in the sensual world, all mentalities arise depending on their own different base. Especially here, for sensual desire, Without heart base, it cannot arise. Always it arises depending on heart base. This is heart base also one cause. Because of color, it means this dose, hmm? since your desire arise. This color also one cause. Okay? Then, there may be color, there may be heart base. But if there is no joiner, how this sensual desire will arise? Joiner is passive contact. That contact connects object and mind to Abhya and mind. <laughs> so because of this, he said, oh, very good, very good. <laughs> you have a lot of sensual desires. Hmm? So this is passive also one cause. But passive alone cannot arise. Sensual desire alone cannot arise. There must be associated mental formations. These associated mental formations are also one cause. Another cause is manasikara, ayoniso manasikara, unwise attention. This is very dangerous one. Very dangerous one means, oh, this is my wife. Oh, this is my husband. If you have such type of attention, this sensual desire is very easy to arise. Very, very quickly will arise. <laughs> is it true? Yes. Ah. If you have, <laughs> <laughs> you have always attention, this is my son, this is my daughter, then this sensual desire will arise very, very quickly. So, this always is attention is proximate cause. What is unwise addition? Unwise addition for idle cognitive process, unwise addition is pido advising consciousness. Mm -hmm. This is very important one. That pido advising consciousness in my moment, there are 11 mental formations, hmm? seven universals, and eh? uh, obligation of the mind, who they got certain. Initial obligation of the mind, we take a sustained obligation of the mind, we chara. These two are also included. Hmm? Then another is uh, uh, hmm? So these three seven universes are Kondek, Pile, Perception, 
होली से वन पॉइंट जेड मेट्स लाइफ फॉर गर्ल डी एडेंशन इस सेवेन यूनिवर्सल्स हैं इस इनिशियल अप्लिकेशन सचरिंग अप्लिकेशन एंड डिसीजन और जो गर्ल लाइफ टीम मेडल फॉर्मेशन एंड दे वन टाइप ऑफ कंसेस्टेंस और जो गर्ल लेवल दिस लेवल्स आर वेरी डेंजरस वन दे इफ दे आर डिसीजन इस राउंड अ होसन जो मास्कुल राइस इफ दे दे आर डिसीजन इस राइ White attention, white decision, then hold on to muscle and relax. This is proximate pause. So, other than you should try to discern the brain origination. The brain origination is not this alone and enough. But I, that sensual bright, 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 uh, sensual desire, right, the brain is more heart based. What is heart based? You must discern four elements in the heart. You can see different types of calabas. If you analyze these calabas, in some calabas there are gamma bone calabas. There are also gamma bone, gamma produce calabas. Embryo produce calabas. Mind produce calabas. Nutritive acid produce calabas. What type of gamma? You must go back to Abdul. The past life. Past life, you may have accumulated one type of karma, whose one karma, which will produce in this material disease. So you must trace when the origin is okay. So in this case, yathaja no bana sa kame chanda sa obado hodi dencha baja dadi. You must try to trace this to when the origin is. But among these causes. Number most important cause is proximal cause is hydro advancing consciousness. Eh? After hydro cognitive process, there are mind of many cognitive process will arise. Among these mind of cognitive process, number one is mind of advancing consciousness. This is very important. The their decision is very dangerous. If they decide. Oh, any wrong way, they a whole sort of must be successfully rising in the same way. How they decide? Super, super, super. <laughs> very beautiful, very beautiful. Uh, uh, <laughs> you are always seen with open eyes. Very beautiful. You like very much. And if you hear a song, oh, very good. If you smell, oh, very good. If you taste, oh, very good. If you touch, oh, very good. So these, uh, you decide very good, very good, very good, very good. Super, super, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Hands on, hands on, hands on. In this way, if you decide, this is that decision is called super nimitta. If you decide in this way, super as super. The sensual desire will increase day by day. When it is increased day by day, you cannot depart, you cannot divorce each other. <laughs> so day by day they will increase. If they are increasing day by day, they will pull not to go away from each other, not to go away from this war, not to go, not to escape from this round of impact. So they are always pulling because of this reason. Why in this sensual desire arise? We must try to understand. This is also one cause. Then this is third sentence. Then fourth sentence. We are both that thought. No. Yathaja bhina sa yathaja no obana sa kame chanda sa bhana hodi tenja bhajana di. A big who understands how they are going to be the abandoning of the reason consciousness, reason sensual desire, reason sensual desire. How you should remove this sensual desire? You should try the method. How to describe this sensual desire? You should also try to understand this method. Oh, you should practice. Hmm? 
So there are <coughs> different ways. Hmm? Different among different ways, Buddha explains number one is Asuka. Asuka Bhavita Bharagasa Bhanaya. To destroy attachment, craving, you must bring this Asuka Bhavana. Asuka Bhavana means hmm? there are ten types of Asuka Bhavana. Huh? Taking up repulsiveness meditation. But many, many guys, they don't like repulsiveness. So, they should, they use another word, an attractive nature. An attractive nature object. Hmm? Asuba nime. So, there are ten times of asuba nime. Hmm? Number one, the swelling cops. Number one, hmm? swelling cops. Number two, the balloon cops, hmm? color change balloon. Hmm? Number three, the four star ring cops. Number four, the uh, fish huge cops. Hmm? Hmm. Number five, mangrove cops. Number six, this member cops. <laughs> Number seven, the cut in this member cup. Number eight, the blasphemous cup. Number nine, the wrong uh, wami cup. Number ten, cup that has begun skeleton. <laughs> so you must you must say one type, one or two or three or maybe this different types of cup as object. How you should practice? Now, some meditators, eh, they have the a day, Anabana Abdul Pok Chana or Kasina, or Kasina Abdul Pok Chana. For them, it is very easy. Imagine from their Pok Chana. With the assistance of the light of wisdom, they should focus the cause which they had been experienced before. And then they should pay attention as particular, particular, hmm? uh, attractive object hmm? or repulsive object. Hmm? Particular, particular, in this way they should pay attention there. So strong, powerful absorption will arise on that top object. At the time, you should maintain this full absorption, up to one hour, two hour, etc. Imagine from that full absorption, if you desire, Janapadas, you can see here by Janapadas clearly. This is one way of Asuba Bhavana. This is in any way Asuba Bhavana, a Vinyanaga Asuba Bhavana. Another way of practice is Dhadidupas. In Grimananda Sota, this Dhadidupas, if you contemplate this Dhadidupas as particular Hibasiva, hmm? then this meditation also called Asuba Bhavana in Krimananda Sutta. So, one part or many parts, hmm? taking as object, you can contemplate them as particular, particular. Then you can attain jhana. This is only part jhana because the object is very repulsive. Hmm? Because of this reason, without Initial obligation and sustained obligation, you cannot maintain your concentration for a long time. Because of this reason, you cannot go on second jhana, third jhana, etc. from this object. Because object is very reversible. Hmm? But for some meditators, hmm? if they can see the cops, if they have been experiencing this cops maybe two years ago, Mm. <coughs> From three years up to this day, this cause may be changed systematically in different stages. Maybe now skeleton only. So, with assistance of their foot channel like, mm? they can, if they can design these different stages, then within one setting also you can design these different types of, types of cops, mm? asuba. 
In the same way, with the assistance of fourth channel, like if they discern 32 verses, they can easily understand 32 verses. Maybe if this 32 verses you divide into different parts, then put only different. Which part do you prefer? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe this is very important. So your wisdom faculty should do this type of, such type of work. Hmm? You, your wisdom faculty have enough power to divide this 32 bus and put on the table. <laughs> and then you can ask to yourself, which part do you prefer? Hmm? At that time, since you have desire me, disappear slowly. So because of this reason, you should try to understand the cause to just try since you are designer. But this is only some of that. But in we personal stage there is also a super one type of asuba pavana. How you should contemplate asuba in we basana. If you had me already this argument mediated Ultimate mentality in their causes as nature to cut And then again, you must this ultimate materiality. If you see this color pass, hmm? please penetrate their nature. They are always associated with pet smell, pet color. Hmm. So, because of this reason, they are. Beautiful or no? Beauty? No beautiful. Asuba, repassive only. So, seeing this bad smell, association of bad smell, bad color, etc., you should also be addressing this ultimate body ready as asuba, asuba. Mm -hmm. Not only nature, doka, and but you must also be addressing as asuba. This is vipassana. Another Ultimate mentality, how you should be addition with Vasana. A whole lot of mass. They produce different types of bad results. After that, they will produce to be reborn in four whole states. So they are repressive only. So all a whole lot of mass are repressive. So you must contemplate them as nature to cut them. And asuba. But again, there are whole lot of mass. How they can be repressive? So whole sons of mass are also repressive. How? Oh. Depending on this whole sons of mass, so a whole sons of mass may arise. Do you understand? Maybe you offer here food, for example. Rice is cooked, not fully cooked. <laughs> <laughs> you have a lot of happiness. Hmm? The or who's on the map, a happiness arise. Is it true? <laughs> so, sometimes you may offer cook and get offer. They cannot offer. In this way, you may have a lot of pride. So, the building or who's on the map, a who's on the map may arise. This is one. In the same way, now you are meditating. Oh, they have no concentration. I have a lot of concentration. Ah, <laughs> you may have a lot of problem. Huh? So, depending on who's on the mark, uh, who's on the mark may arise. If, depending on who's on the mark, if they arise on who's on the mark, then these who's on the mark are also repressive. So, you can contemplate them as asuba, asuba. This is a vipassana. That Asuba Bhavana is the only instrument to remove, to destroy sensual desire. So you must try to understand how you should remove, how you should destroy this sensual desire. These are instruments to cut the sensual desire. Hmm? Another is when you break this Vipassana stage by stage systematically, one day when you are inside knowledge become mature. Then, at the end of your inside knowledge, but approaching knowledge will rise stage by stage. Hmm? Taking Nirvana as object. Hmm? If you attain a hardship, your arhat knowledge will destroy 
completely without removing the disk since you are designing it. Okay, so <coughs> at that time you will understand the instrument which cuts the since you are designing it completely without removing it. But previously you may write this semantra asuba pavana. That asuba jana ke just try since you are designing it temporarily only. If you get in that into jana wa awa the other day, since you are designing it will not arise. Hmm? But when you are practicing with basana, that with basana inside also can just try since you are designing it temporarily only. When you do not write this with Vasana other than this, since your designer will preach it to your mind again. But if you attain part in approaching knowledge, especially up to Rahampat knowledge, then you are since your designer will not write. And so this is one instrument, one way. Another way is obligation to the development of excess concentration. This is not only asubat meditation, but other excess concentration, such as anabana or kasina, or any excess concentration of full absorption states. Hmm? And then also this excess concentration and absorption concentration can just try since you are desired temporarily. Temporarily means when you are Concentration is developing further. If you can maintain this concentration, one hour, two hours, etc., other than this situation, then you will not visit to your mind. So, this concentration also can remove. Because of this reason, if you are practicing samatha, then you must try to practice samatha continuously every, every body bocha. Why? This situation, then you may visit to your mind frequently because you are staying as a household house householder. So because of this reason many attachments are occasionally visiting to your mind. So to protect this you should put your mind on the your meditation object only. So to put this this, this way of practicing thing, you must try number three, guarding the six doors. You must cut six doors. How you should cut your six doors? Yes, one so that combo from a so that. So twice. Is it true? So twice. One day, so twice are also searching for food on the bank of a river. Fox also searching for food on the big of river, but sharing this. Tortoise also see the fox. Hmm? Fox also see the tortoise. So, fox approach to the tortoise to eat. At the day, tortoise pounce to two hands, two legs. Hmm? Put in his, in his chair. His head he put in his chair. His tail he put his in his chair. Six. Six limbs he put in his chair. Uh, fox cannot eat because chair is very strong. Hmm? Mm -hmm. Then fox waiting. If one limb is coming up, I will pipe hmm? and eat. In this way, fox is waiting, but he cannot eat. Doctors also understand. <coughs> He is waiting for me. So <laughs> 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 he is going to pull out his limbs. So slowly, fox began tired and go away. In the same way, because you must put your mind on your meditation object. This meditation object is your share. In your share, you must always put your mind. If you cannot put your mind in your shell, pox, pox is the final mess. Eh? They will bite you and eat. Is it true? Yes. yes. So yes. because of this reason, you must always put your mind in your shell. What is shell? Meditation object. Eh? When you are bright, they say, samatha, 
You must put always your mind in yourself. When you are afraid, they say, Vipassana, Vipassana is yourself. You must always meditate Vipassana. At the day, <coughs> Pox hmm? or the Pilamis hmm? will you not visit to your mind. Hmm? So, Kadi, the six toes is from six toes, I, ear, nose, that and body, mind, toe. From these toes, the final man is not to visit to you. So you must cut these six toes. How you should cut? You must always stay in your share. What is share? Meditation object. Okay? Please stay. The another is <coughs> moderation in food. <laughs> this is very important. <coughs> If you eat a lot, uh, <laughs> <laughs> you know, many day well, eh? but if there is no enough food, and then that also you cannot many day. Eh? Oh, moderation food means what? Moderation in food. For example, if you are eating pudding muscles, hmm? pudding muscles, pudding spoon, hmm? then you should eat 35 only. Instead, you should drink water for five. Hmm? If you are eating 60, <laughs> 60 mozzarella, hmm? 60 spoon, then you should eat only 55. Five mozzarella you should not eat. Instead, you should drink water. This is moderation in poop. But <coughs> there is also another explanation. This is Benariva Sariputta's suggestion. Another explanation is, as you imagine that you should eat only four or five more cells only. <laughs> no more. Then instead you should eat, then you should drink water. This will be well, friends, eh? All sorts of things. Maybe you should associate it with noble ones. Noble friends, good friends, good ones, hmm? who can teach you how you should contemplate, how you should meditate. In this way, they can discuss with you how to remove your sense desire, how you should destroy this sense desire, etc. In this way, if they teach you, they, it is beneficial to you. Uh, if you associate with gossip, hmm? many persons who are always trying to gossip. If you associate with such persons, you are concentrating with Porto. So, especially in this case, hmm, who had a lot of compassion to you, as well as can teach you systematically, such type of teachers is necessary, help is necessary. <coughs> the another is hmm, stimulating to that help the accomplishment of the object in view. Stimulating talk is missing. Put the talk which should be stimulate to you to remove this such type of sensual desires. Hmm? So such type of talk is necessary. Or oh, good. What such type of talk? Maybe, for example, oh, how you should practice Asuba Mamana, or you should practice Asuba in this way, in this way. How you should practice Vipassana, or you should practice in this way, in this way. How you should practice Anabana, oh, Anabana, you should practice in this way. So such type of help is necessary. Such type of talking also necessary, if you do not understand well. Hmm? If you understand well, you, you, you the way of practice, huh? it is not necessary to discuss too much. If you do not understand, then it is necessary to discuss such type of talk. Huh? So because of this, this all together, this six way. Huh? If you practice these six ways, eh, then one day when you are inside knowledge become mature, then at the end of your inside knowledge part and fruition, knowledge has, will arise, taking Nibbana as object. That's this part and fruition knowledge has, <coughs> that's why the, this sensual desire completely without remainder. Eh? At that time, 
Already had to be abandoned before. Hmm? So, this is especially referring to Rampa knowledge. When you add a Rampa knowledge, when, when you are reflecting your defilements, you will not see any defilements which are present in your mental series. Other than you, are, uh, you will understand, oh, this is a Rampa knowledge, is the only instrument can destroy the sexual desire completely without coming down. Other than only sexual desire will be ceased completely without coming down. You should understand this instrument also. If you do not understand this way of practice, then sexual desire will be always visited into your mind. Hmm? So these are five ways. Hmm? I will explain again. Hmm? Sandawa Nabawa, Sandawa Ejanda Gami Chanda, Atime Ejanda Gami Chanda Di Bajanda Di. They are being sexual desire in you. You must try to understand their sexual desire in me. As Sandawa Ejanda Gami Chanda, Natime Ejanda Gami Chanda Di Bajanda Di. There are being no sexual desire in you. You should try to understand. There is no sexual desire in me. No, number three, yet I check no banasa, come each and as a obado honey in chap bajanadi. You should try to understand <coughs> how they are come to be the uh, rising of sexual desire which not yet arisen uh, before. Hmm? How sexual desire arise in you? Hmm? You should try to understand because of you pay addition beauty. Hmm? Then another is Yatraja Obanasa Kami Chandasa Bahana Hodi Dinsha Bajanadi. You should try to understand how there comes to be the abandoning of reason since you desire. Number five. Yatraja Bahinasa Kami Chandasa Ayadi No Bada Hodi Dinsha Bajanadi. You should try to understand how they are going to be the future no rising of reason sensual desire. You already destroyed by Ahampa knowledge. So this fight you must try to understand. So if you try to understand this sensual desire in these five ways, then you may understand, you must already understand you, you had already designed Adimit mentality, Adimit materiality together with sensual desire. You must already design dependent origination. You will understand. Hmm? Then you must contemplate there as nature to another absolute rampa knowledge. So all are included in this five sentences. If you understand sensual desire in this way, then you will be escaped from the karma environment. Okay. <coughs> Any question? <coughs> Any question? So, go, um, so seeing an object, a color that you like, so the mind adverting um, consciousness, and then there's a decision that comes immediately. Immediately is not easy. Not easy means when color invents both those, usually hydro-advertic consciousness arises. But this is general design, probably. After hydro-cognitive process, they arise going up. After many boingas, there is a cognitive process taking this color as object. This mind cognitive process 
again gave the attention. If they rise five times, for example, at the day, fifth mind of community thoroughly can decide. Oh, very good, very good, very good. This decision is especially mind of cognitive process. But in fact, the mind of cognitive process also has decision. But that decision is not real decision. They translate this wow to bendy wea. Wow to bendy wea means as if they are deciding only. Because I do cognitive process understand only just color. This color is whose color they do not understand. I do cognitive process. But after I do cognitive process, many boingas, after many boingas, they mind your cognitive process. Then boinga, then mind your cognitive process. Then boinga, then mind your cognitive process. In this way, many cognitive process arise. When they arise up to five times, at the time, the fifth mind your cognitive process, or fourth mind your cognitive process, can decide, oh, this is my son. This is my daughter, this is my wife, this is my husband, this is US dollar. <laughs> In this way, they can decide this. Mm -hmm. At that time only, that decision produces a strong powerful sensual design. Mm -hmm. But in idle community process, there's also sensual design, and this is very weak. Because of this weakness, they cannot produce any new existence. They can produce um, bad results. In kind of body, body means between but consciousness and that consciousness along the line, they can produce different uh, but results. Mm -hmm. um, you, uh, Sayana, you were talking about how people become attached to their attachments, and I was just wondering what what happens to somebody who has family that becomes an arahant. How do they relate to their mother, their father, their children, their spouse if they're married? To the to the observer looking at this person, how would they be relating to those same family members now that they've lost all attachment? When they become a hat, for example, they cannot stay as a household householder. Quickly, they must go in post. They must ordain as a bhikkhu or bhikkhuni. And then, then they can maintain their lives. But if they begin at her, for example, hmm? at her, they will not see this is son, this is daughter, this is father, this is mother. How they see? There is Siddhartha Vihari. Sarita Vihari, the meaning of Sarita Vihari is permanent dwelling. They are permanent dwelling, permanent house. Dwelling, ho permanent dwelling house is Anicca, Druka, Anatta. <laughs> they always see five aggregates. They always see twelve ironas. They always see eighty elements. They always see dependent origination patterns. They are always a nature, Dukkha, Ananda. They always see. Intentionally, if they try to see men or women, at that time only they see men or women temporarily. But always they are seeing a nature, Dukkha, Ananda. As soon as they arise, they are always passing on. They can see always. So because of this reason, for Arahats, they have no attachment. Because Arahabha knowledge, they try to completely with our mind the attachment to each other. But, before our heart stage, there is one stage, Anagami stage. That Anagami part knowledge also, 75, huh? 75% they can see and they try to look at another. Because of this reason, they also can destroy sensual desire. This since we are sensual desire only, not for attachment to the Brahmawa. So, because of this reason, although they may see to each other, they have no attachment to each other. Because sensual, sensual attachment, they already destroyed by anagami knowledge. 
Because of this reason, hmm, so I had to Visaka in the Mastina. One day Visaka went to the monastery. He listened to my talk from the Buddha. He began in Nagami. When he came back to his house on that day, he never see his wife, Tamadina, with attachment. Tamadina, Tamadina began surprise. Every day when he came back from Buddha's monastery, he is, she is always welcoming. He also very happy, he also very happy. But on that day, Tamadina gave her hand. Which I can never touch, never see. Okay, they have no attachment. Because a Nagami part, that's trying to completely this attachment. In the same way, do chili drinks also say. But Tamadina also have an me. So she asked, this Tama can be realized by men only, or women also can cannot realize. Or oh, women also can realize this Tama. Oh, so then I will order. Please. Hmm? Forgive me to order as a bikuni. Okay, you can go. Eh? Then, yes, hall. Do you know hall? They put on the hall the Madina. They carry with shoulders eh, to the monastery eh, to order as a bikuni. Then, the Madina try hard. She began her heart. So, after, began, after she had been already ending her ship, one day, Wisaka and Tamadina, they meet to each other. Wisaka want to test Tamadina, whether she will come back to household life or not, whether she will disturb or not. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> so, because of this reason, he test many Tama questions. Tamadina gave proper answers. So these answers, question answers are mentioned in Mishima Nikaya. This is called Chula Vitala Soda. Because of this Chula Vitala Soda, Tamadina began the top Tamakatika, like Sister Susila. <laughs> <laughs> top Tamakatika among Vekunis. So if they had children, yes. would they have the same would they be left by their parents? <coughs> it depends on children's parami. If children have enough parami, they can also be arhas. But if they have no parami, if they don't want to meditate, then how we can say? <laughs> quite understand one of the connections uh, in your talk. You said uh, in the uh, if you have one of those mind door processes, let's say the fourth or the fifth, and then you have that in, uh, decision consciousness. And I think it was with the decision one that there were 11 mental factors? Maybe that decision is gone. Oh, okay. Uh, and then you said oh, one of those, maybe it was the mind door adverting consciousness has 11? Maybe mental factors are 11. Plus with consciousness, they are 12. Ah, uh, okay. And then, uh, and then you said that one has, is the dangerous one because that makes, that decides beautiful. Maybe dangerous right? means for a whole time to much, this is dangerous. <laughs> unwholesome. For a whole time to much, this is not dangerous. Sorry. So, so for unwholesome then, and then you, you go back and you do dependent origination and you look at kama and see the effect. Um, but how, let's say with color, uh, how does that reduce the, the defilement uh, uh, or, or the, the, the idea that something is beautiful? You may understand the, 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 the reason why, but then uh, w why do you need to understand the reason? If, it, if you know that it's, it's not good, then just practice those methods that you said. Why Why understand the reason? So you don't do it again or something? Maybe this is also previous experience. This is important. Mm -hmm. Previously, he had been experiencing such type of object. Hmm? Again, again. 
So he had the experience or he had the feel this is good. So this is previous. Again, next time if you see, oh, this is very good. That decision is there again. Because of previous experience. But if, if you experience any object, if you do not care, then such type of sensual desire will not arise. But if you had been experienced before, such type of object is, if you again meet, then that decision is very strong because of previous experience. In other words, <coughs> this is called Yoniso Manasikara or Ayoniso Manasikara. For those who are this one, this type of consciousness, mind and body consciousness, is called Yoniso Manasikara. For a whole of us, this is Ayoniso Manasikara. Real Yoniso Manasikara or the real Ayoniso Manasikara is a whole of us or a whole of us only. Really. But that whole of and a whole of us are previous experience. Previously, you had met this object before. Then, when you meet again this object, then you decide. You want to make you want decision. Maybe you want to make a cigar or you want to make a cigar. For example, now you had been this ultimate materiality, ultimate mentality, and then there are causes. And then you had been already contemplated as nature to get another. This ah. Your inside knowledge is working. Again, next day when you meditate again, then if you contemplate this nature, uh, this ultimate mentality, mentality, they are causes as nature to the another. Then this mind do advantage consciousness became powerful because of previous experience. So at that time, that decision is very strong. In the same way, when you see any color object, as long as you see, you do not. He said, "This is very beautiful, but there must there must be previous experience. How previous? Maybe few minutes or few seconds or maybe few hours ago. You had been experienced such object. Again, <coughs> when you experience again this object, at that time this mind do had one consciousness very strong, powerful because of previous supporting God. So at the time, at the time that he said, this is good, this is not good, in this way." I I think so. So 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 uh, the reason you focus on kama then in that dependent origination is to see that build up of of um, attachment to that particular object, right? This is also we call this is temperament. Temperament means as a latent tendency. This temperament is as a passing way. For example, when you are accumulating. Hosandama in previous life. That Hosandama is surrounded by attachment. Open mm -hmm. example is, for example, you have one girlfriend. When you are accumulating Hosandama in previous life together with that girlfriend, you wish for to meet each other in future in this life. For example. Mm -hmm. huh? So, attachment temperament, as the attachment last last pull temperament is always going as a underlying tendency in your mentality, material series. Because of this reason, in this that when you see to each other, that a lot attachment is appear very strong because of this whole sonoma. Because this whole sonoma is surrounded by attachment to each other, like our. Uh, with Sandra in the Sodra, uh, with Sandra in Panda, huh? mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. or like Sejata in the Sodra. When the Sodra sees Sejata, she cannot control her mind. <laughs> <laughs> she has a lot of attachment to Sejata. Sejata also say <laughs> Because of previous Hosan Thomas, these Hosan Thomas are surrounded by attachment to each other. Okay, so that's the ca that's the ca that's the origin of the suffering that you're determining, and then yes, yes, yes. you use these methods that you describe yes, yes. to to uh, to make the cessation of suffering. Yes, very good. Okay. 
Now you are single. If you wish for to be single always, then you will be very good one day. <laughs> so that I'm a little bit just a little bit confused um, about two people having the desire to be together in a future life um, because that points to like some entity that travels from life to life that could... How is it possible that two people can come together in a future life? There are four causes. Maybe I'm explaining only one cause. Mm -hmm. Sada, Sila, Tiaga, Pinya. Sada is a lot of confidence to the Buddha, Dhamma, Sangha, and the law of the activity of the law of karma. Sada. Both must be equal. This one. Saga, generosity. Generosity must be both equal. If maybe husband want to offer, but uh, wife against, hmm? what called? For what? Hmm? Prohibit. Yeah. Yeah. But wife want to offer, but husband prohibit. This is we cannot say they have same saga, same same generosity. So both must have same saga, same mm -hmm. generosity. This is one. Then sila purification of virtue. Both must be same purification of virtue. Mm -hmm. Husband. No purification of Paju. He always drinking. <laughs> <laughs> White has purification of Paju. This is also impossible to meet each other in future. So, another is Pinya, wisdom faculty. What is wisdom faculty? In this case, Pinya is especially Vipassana inside knowledge. Husband also brightness Vipassana. Um, of the Vipassana state, he already discerned a demon, middle, limit, and diagnosis as an example of another. He also understands what also understands in the same way. So these four factors must be same. If these four are same, then mm -hmm. this pure they will meet in future. But if they, this one of these are not same, then it is not sure to meet each other in future. Because because of the uh, one has no virtuous one, he always get, he always see, he also do sexual misconduct, etc. Huh? Always telling lies, etc. One is puri observe purification of virtue. They cannot be saying one will go to her, one will go to her. <laughs> <laughs> so they cannot mix with each other. <laughs> so. So is it as the two comic streams are just yes 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 maybe for example our body said that say that that eh? yes or that they have same 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 mm -hmm. same means if say that that offers sons and daughters to others yes or that never prohibit if yes or that offer then say that that never prohibit yes they have same purification of virtue they have same understanding. They have hmm? uh, same generosity. Hmm? Mm -hmm. So because of this reason, always they meet to each other in a long sansara. Hmm. It, it seems so, I have to say, it seems so unlikely because <laughs> from... <laughs> 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 seems like karma follows us, and it, something that's ripening now might be from five lifetimes ago or something. So for two people to match up like that seems impossible. Maybe strong, strong is impossible. Impossible means not always. Human mind is always thinking. Now they may have such a desire to meet to each other. Sometimes they quarrel. 
<laughs> they don't want to be spiritual. <laughs> 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 when it changes, because of this, this uh, you can also easily always. <laughs> Sama, 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 Sama,